such a man who loved his wife so much he should have so much hated against that person but rama says that enmity ends with death when vibhishana refuses to perform those funeral rites as rama's work sprung from internal peace he had no bitterness in his heart for his foe the work was done according to rama the task was accomplished and he had nothing nothing left to say about ravana even when consoling vibhishana he says that he tries to focus on the positive qualities of ravana not that there are many but he tries his best and he says that ravana was a great warrior and that um, he will attain the stature of warriors as as they do so in this way we can see that rama is not it's you can never define him as one thing rama is a warrior yes he is a warrior but he is so much more rama is a king maker yes he is defines the laws as we see when he talks with with uh, vali we can see how he makes the laws and how he is so knowledgeable about law making and politics rama is a friend as we see in the uh, sakya bhavas yes he is a friend but he is still more than that rama is a ekadara vratan yes rama is a ekadara vratan but anything that you continue saying about rama it's not enough to contain his personality as we move on and we see more and more rama's true nature and his goals are reflected between the words of ramayana so this sort of angle of rama can only be accessed if you're ready to see him not just as a warrior and a king maker but as his holistic and overall personality as a guiding force and the very embodiment of dharma itself as maricha says in aranya kandam ramo vigravan dharmaha so vigravan means not just dharma is what one part of him or it's something that guides him in life he is the very embodiment of dharma itself so in that way he is able to encompass all the tools and all the personality aspects that contribute towards dharma